audio goes out. I've got this open. Oh, shit, you know what? I just realized. I have to log back into my Twitch account, because right now, I'm logged into... The bot. Uh, the bot. So people are hearing us on the channel. I'm just like, oops. Good job, man. Good job. Oh my god, now it's making me authenticate. Really? Hi, everyone. It's just testing you. It is. I swear. But hi, chat. How's everyone doing? Oh my god, is my number lock not on? It was not on. Today is like... I hate when that happens. <laughs> I'm just like, what's happening? There we go. Chat's running. Bot's running. Siri bot's running. Cool, cool, cool. But how are you, Taru? I'm... Tired, but doing okay. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I, the audio just got so good for me. The audio got what? I'm sorry. The audio just like improved tenfold. Hey, Furwick, how are you? I just hate the mic on this one because I feel like it always sounds like I'm like I'm trying to eat the mic. How are you, mm. Furwick? Hey, Court. All right, let's see if we can do this from my laptop. Uh, all right, there we go. Oh, that is very close. Hello, I'm very much in the computer's guts right now. Oh no, not all the work stuff. All right, let's see if I can make this not like in so deep into this computer that But how are you beside just waking up? How's the future, Furwick? Oh, yeah, it is the future for you. All right. So I'm also trying not to smack the camera as I unbox stuff. Ooh, fancy. Hey, Gord. Hey, Catalina. No worries. Well, we're putting together as much as we can because uh, most of the drives that are going in this machine are still in my actual computer. So, but look, ow, sorry, I sure did slap the, the, uh, I did the very thing I was trying not to do, which was slap the, the camera. Oh, Rog gives a bunch of stuff. I was going to say, if they gave That's me... That's a smexy looking motherboard. Why, thank you. It is a uh, Asus Rog. And uh, so this is the, the motherboard that's going in, if people can see it. And thanks for the reset, Catalina. Um, lose a few client emails. <laughs> nice. Yeah, so this is an up. <laughs> oh my god, there's stickers. Not that I'm going to put stickers on my machine. So, uh, do you ever put sticker the stickers that come with your motherboard on the machine? No. But some of them are pretty cool looking. Hey, Rowan. Uh, kind of. We are, we are um, building a new computer from, well, not from scratch. I didn't make the case, obviously. But I'm also trying to figure out the best way to put this in here. I'm like, where's all my parts? Oh, this isn't talent, Court. This is many years of, of trying and failing. Oh, check it. Oh, this is the Wi-Fi thingy. What's the right word for it? The antenna. The antenna? The adapter? Yeah. yeah. 
I had one for my current PC. I never set it up. I hardline my PC, so. Same, but I think it's supposed to be like a, hey, here's a, a way to um, improve your Wi-Fi signal. Oh, hmm. look, they even give you like a, a grounding strap. Or is it like a like a key fob yep. thingy? Or maybe. I don't know what that is. No, uh, there have been many years where I have absolutely fucked up building a PC. Either <laughs> I didn't do something right. Cable ties, those are important because there will be so many cords. They didn't give me screws, I don't think. How the fuck are you supposed to mean like to put... the pegs? No, those are in the case. You know, the actual screws. There's like... Oh, one screw in here. Are you serious? Do we not have fucking screws? I will yell if they sold me a motherboard without screws. Yes, thingy is the most correct uh, terminology, but it looks like they sold me this thing without any screws. So, Adina, I'm putting in the motherboard. Also, I'm just going to say this now. I've been building computers a long time. Unless I ask for assistance, I have Taru on the mic, and I will have Pirate and Mandy on it. Um, so, unless I explicitly ask for help or, or commentary, I've been building PCs a very long time. To the point where I expect to have screws for the motherboard. I know there are latches for the SSD because it's on the other side of the case that you all cannot see. Hey, serious. Okay, so I may have to go hunt for some screws. You all may get to come with me. I know I've got screws in this house because I've built quite a few machines. But yeah, there are no screws in here unless I'm, you know what, I'm goofy. Hmm. I might need, no, because that is, no, hmm, hey magic. Yeah, because I'm putting in the motherboard first so that the latches have literally nothing to do with it. Huh, well, shit. Hmm. I'm used to motherboards coming with a set of screws. All right, so uh, I'm going to either put the other case that's on the floor behind me up on this table, and we're going to steal the screws from that motherboard, because that is my old computer that stopped working. Uh, Sorry, you all are getting crinkle ASMR. Look, I, I don't know if they assume you just have screws or if I need to look at the uh, case and if I'm supposed to pull... They might be in the case. The question is where? Because this case has been here for a minute. Um, oh. No, that Usually case... they're in the back in a little box if you're going to get them with the case. Yeah, I'm just looking through all the accoutrement that is on this desk, or table, I should say. So, funny story, the reason I have this uh, case here, and there's nothing in it, when my other computer decided to try to die, aha, I found them, success. I found the screws. I had just taken them out. Um... Also, did you all know that computers get very hot? Uh, there's so much hot air pumping out of my poor laptop right now. I may have to turn on the fan even with the windows open. Success! We found screws! They're not labeled, but they're here. <laughs> Tiny screws. Um... Uh, and Taru, you will see that I've, oh, 
taken out the top fan so I can get the eventually get the liquid cooling in for the CPU. Excellent. Ooh, there's a bunch of cords that have slid out of the other side of the case. Come back here. Those are all the ways I get to connect the motherboard. Ha ha. Success. My least favorite part of cables and motherboards are the little tiny guys that are all like the front buttons, like your power button, your, all those little guys. You have to like perfectly put them in in the right order with like little pluses and minuses. Uh-huh. Yeah, that's I, my least favorite part of building computers. <laughs> I hate that part. Luckily, it's gotten yep. much easier now. When I started building computers, ooh, it was a struggle, and you could very easily fuck up everything with one wrong connection or break a pin. Yep. Front headers are the devil. All right. I have yep. the windows open. I'm going to turn on the fan. If it's too much noise, let me know. I put it on the lowest setting. So we found the screws. Crisis averted. Because it's too late to go out to Micro Center now. Yeah. Well, it's not. But it would have been a very short stream. <laughs> like, well, like, well, we tried. So now. Gold star for trying. It's like, you try. I actually have a wooden, um, I actually have a wooden pin that says you tried. Ow. Also. <laughs> nice. This thing is sharp. Hmm. Oh, there we go. I'm like, how's this going again? Okay, the the wind from the fan is going to annoy me, but I'm also hot. I feel like this fan might have to come out just so I can get the motherboard in, because I think it's in the way. So funny story that I started to say before I realized I didn't have screws. Um, all right, so I'm going to sit down because this fan has to come out, and I got to remember which way it's facing because that's the other thing that a uh, pirate was talking about of trying to remember which way the fans were facing. So. Uh, my old computer croaked on me yes, last year. Airflow is. Oh yeah. It's just which way was this facing? Oh, I have to remember it's facing. With the with the black label out of the case. Oh, it shouldn't be uh, court. I've done this many times before. It's just I haven't done this in a while because my last few computers were either. Provided by a sponsor, hashtag AMD, or I bought it off the shelf because my other computer fucking croaked and I had no option. So has it now been a year? I came back from PAX and my computer just croaked. It legit just fucking croaked. Alright, so remember it was facing out that way. The course here was facing in. Got it. So I'm putting these screws back in here so we don't lose them because now there's a bunch of million tiny little pieces around. Um, but yeah, now I can actually see where the motherboard goes. So even if we don't finish the full build today, this is still going to be plenty to do in one shot. Because connecting all of these tiny things is a whole lot of work. Yeah, I usually set aside about four hours if I'm doing a full build. Yeah, the the problem is now I need to... Oh, excuse me. I need to sneeze. Ooh. Um. <laughs> Jory, you okay? Jory's like, I'm sweating. <laughs> you know, if I did not think I could do this myself, I absolutely would not be trying to do this, especially not on stream. <laughs> Um, it wouldn't explode, Court. I mean, the, it would have to have power, so we're safe from explosion. Nothing's plugged in. The power supply is not even in the case. Um, I 
Yeah, and at the end of the day, worse that happens is you get thermal paste somewhere it shouldn't go, and you fry your motherboard, and you go, oops, that was an expensive mistake, and you go get a new one. Yeah, I mean, hopefully... I'm sure people have done it, because I've seen people absolutely fuck up a brand new build, and in fact, um, even though I keep distracting myself from the story I keep trying to tell, um, a friend of mine years ago... We helped her get all the pieces for a computer. Jory, it's so much easier now. Literally, except for the putting the pieces in, and they even made putting in the CPU much easier. Because that was where you could honestly fuck up the worst, is putting in your CPU once the motherboard was in. Um, but you know when you always have that one friend that tries to be helpful and they're not? One of our friends was there and decided he knew better than me in putting in the CPU. Guess what he did? He put Did he the, bend a whole bunch of pins? He bent enough pins to where the CPU would not land because now that's why there's a notch to indicate which way the CPU goes. That is why there's now a notch. So I don't I don't know if you can tell yet, but this notch here, that is so you know which way the CPU goes on here. And that's why it's there. Oh yeah, he absolutely, I was like, you're going to Micro Center right now. We're not doing this, because you fucked this up. Oh, this is recess. This is far as it goes. Huh. Well, I learned. I'm used to these sticking out and being flush to the case. This is far as mm. this goes. I'll, Interesting. I'll, yeah, I mean, on the one hand, it's flush, but on the other, I'm so used to them basically sticking out. Like, oh, I almost closed the stream. Good job, me. I do not have much space where I'm working. And this fan is in the fucking way. I didn't expect to have to take the back fan off, too. Alright, screws, let's go! Oh yeah, he absolutely had to go get her a new CPU. And I was like, I'm gonna go with you and make sure you come back, because you fucked it up, because you didn't let me do it. Mm-hmm. And I'm just like... Why y'all, why people gotta be like this? Alright, where's my smaller Phillips? Aha. Uh Aha. -huh. Uh -huh. Nope, that is a smaller <laughs> flathead. Nice, Ferwick. What did Ferwick say? Close the tab of a Google Meet for a meeting I was running. Oh, no. And neither confirm nor deny that I did that. <laughs> you know, some days it'd be like that, Ferwick. You're like, you know what? I ain't wanna be in this meeting, no way. I like about these screwdrivers, and I didn't realize this, they're magnetic. Ba 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 bum. Right? Why, Jory? I mean, and I'm not trying to make light of it, because it would be a very expensive mistake if I fuck this up right now. Um. Uh, we're talking quite a bit of money if I fuck this up. Um, sorry for for the wind noise. I'm trying to move the fan. But also, being menopausal and roaming around is a lot. Hey, Kay. Well, come on in, y'all. Can I get a shout-out for Chaotic Wholesome? Oh, no, Rowan. Oh no. Oop, these are short. I should have used these other ones somewhere. Well, it's a good thing this is magnetic. Because some of these are shorter than the others. Hey, Rex. Welcome in. Mm. Welcome in. I mean, really, the only way you can honestly fuck up putting in the motherboard is if you press down too hard and break it. Or, well, that's not coming out. 
So that must be the right length screw. I mean, absolutely. And granted, I put all this on a credit card, so it's not money, money, but it's still money, you know? Mm-hmm. Eventually, I have to pay that money to Best Buy. Hey, Lamia. Hey, Mandy. Or they will come find you. Oh, absolutely. They'll be like, so about that money. About all the expensive shit you put on your card and you ain't paid us yet. Uh, Mandy, check uh, the, the DM with me, you and Pirate. Okay, I found where the short screw goes. I think a short screw is supposed to go here. It would be helpful if they said, put the short screw here because they only give you three of them. And if the windy noise is bothering you, Taru, or anyone in chat, just let me know. I'm not hearing any of the fan noise, so your mic is doing an excellent job of blocking it. Okay, for you, I can hear it and it's driving me wild. Uh, <laughs> I'll have to figure out where my M2 drives go on here. Because I bought two. I'm guessing they go under these things. Well, oh yeah, Jory, if there's anywhere you can, um, practice on an old machine, that is ideal. That's how I learned, honestly, when my partner would upgrade his machine, he would show me, I would watch him. All right, and the motherboard is in. Now, where the fuck are the instructions so I know what's what on this motherboard before I unscrew something I shouldn't? <laughs> uh, but the reason I have a totally empty case is when my old computer died last year, I wound up having to use the other machine that um, AMD had sent me as a backup because I didn't have a spare machine and I didn't have the money to just go buy one. So I pulled my drives out of the old machine, put it in the case I'm currently using, Oh no, Jory. Um, okay. So this does explain this. Like, what is what? Hey, Panda. Uh, now that the motherboard's in, I feel pretty good. I'm just trying to see where my NVMEs go. That is, uh, that is the main thing I'm trying to figure out before I put the CPU on. And I do have thermal paste. I didn't forget thermal paste. Yay. If I had to guess, it might be <laughs> under those two black long thingies at the bottom there. Yeah, I'm just looking at the um I'm looking at the instructions. Imagine that. <gasps> Reading I the know. instructions? Ah no. Goodness. Except the sign the... of a true professional. <laughs> Uh, the, the funny thing is the instructions don't show where the NVMe goes. Like, it doesn't have these on the motherboard picture, if that makes hmm. sense. Wait, here it is. A. Oh. Yeah, it's covered up. Like, could you yep. You know, this would be easier if they just let me fucking... I don't know why there's like protective plastic on this shit. Keep and it fancy is... and shiny. It's in a box. Nobody's going to see this shit. <laughs> All right, Nandina, sleep well. I hope you feel better soon. The real nerve-wracking part for me is going to be the uh, CPU. Once that's seated, I will, the rest of it's gravy. Yep. All right, come on. The panic mode of placing the CPU. The panic mode of the CPU and also just... Oh, I 
What the hell? I tabbed out of my own stream. So this is this part is new to me. The last time I built a computer, NVMEs were not common. Mm -hmm. Like the machine I'm using now has one on the board, but it came with it. So, um, and Pirate said he's gonna join us uh, after he walked the good doggo. Oh. Uh, Oh, this is a cover for the NVMe. Okay. So see, there, it's actually a cover. So once you put it in, you're supposed to uh, put that back on. Yep. It helps keep it seated nice and flat and protects it. Oh, imagine that. Actually, um, so the two terabytes going to go here. I'm like, don't let me sit on something sharp. <laughs> You know, I'm a doofus. I would absolutely wind up sitting on, like, a fucking thumbtack or something. Ooh. I do not need the camera exposing me. Right, let me not lose that. Sorry, I'm going to be quiet for a second so I don't cut my hand. I think a pirate just appeared. He did. Hello. Excellent. How goes, pirate? Oh, all right. Just finished walking heroes and wrapping work for the day. So, yeah, you know, back to work of a different kind. Oh, you said you were working on minis, yeah? Yeah, trying to get things wrapped up so that I can be prepped for a new projects starting on Thursday. So. Oh. Let's stuff off the desk. Uh, Sirius says hi. Hi, Sirius. Hey, hey. Uh, oh my god, they're so tiny! These were not common when I last built a machine. Holy shit. Look at that tiny what is, little... What is tiny? The NVMe. Mm. The last time I built a machine all the way through... NVMEs, I don't think even existed, com like, kind of as a standard thing. Well, hey, Panda. All right, now, where's the screw for the NVME? Or is it on the motherboard? Oh, I see what they did. I think. I think I... I'm not sure how this works. So hmm. how is the phenomenally expensive Lego set going? Hey, Joy. Uh, well, once I realized that I had uh, actually did have screws for the motherboard to stay on the motherboard to stay in the case. Maybe yeah, that would help. Well, I this case has been here for a minute and. Uh, I have, at this point, have taken everything out of the box. The box is long gone, and I had to think about where the fuck the, uh, the screws to hold the motherboard had gone. Um, that does not help me at all, so I'm trying to figure out how it attaches. I can't tell from, hey Siri, turn on torch. Okay. Flashlight on. I'm like, does this screw come off? How does this work? I'm trying to figure out like how it attaches. Like, does this screw come off of the board? Does it go back in? So if it's similar to the one that I recently put together, it kind of um, loosens and then you can slide. There's like a half cutout circle for the back end of the NVMe um, card. And then you can tighten it down onto that little like half slot. There is, I'm just like, how does it loosen? I'm like, I just don't want to fuck up like the board by trying to mess with it. Like, do I, do I unscrew it at all or? Yeah, you unscrew it like halfway 
and then you should be able to like slot the um the NVMe card into like the the part where the you know connects and then you kind of gently let it fold down and then you tighten the screw back onto it and that'll hold it flat. I'm just not seeing where it actually unscrews. It's not Oh wait, there we go. I think it actually just comes out. Oh, there we go. It came out. Huzzah. Okay. Yeah, there was an extra NVMe screw in there. I think they have several spaces depending on the length of your NVMe card itself. So mm. it'll match the appropriate length. Got it. All right, go in there. Because y'all, the PlayStation NVMe, this was me trying not to break this fucking thing. All right, why won't we go in? And this is the part where I'm also going to be like, fuck, I broke it. There we go. And then that protective thing actually goes back in. Mm -hmm. Screw to keep it flat, and then protective thing are back on. All right, I just, oh, shit. Well, I just dropped something, and I have no idea where it went. But I did get one extra. Ah, there it is. Because I was like, it didn't hit the floor. So, Pirate, what are you working on? It's it's just more MCP terrain. The, the, this is my entire life right now. The large, bulky things that I desperately need to get off the desk so I can store them and then move on to the next large, bulky thing that will take up my desk for the entire rest of the month. Ah, uh, I see. Mm -hmm. Does this gray part come off, Taru? Sorry, what? Does the gray part come off? The gray part? Yeah, this gray part around the screw, does that come off? Or no? It shouldn't. Okay. Just checking. Oh, wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. That part, yeah. That's, sorry. It, I'm a little bit delayed on being able to see the video. Oh, okay. So basically, I'm wondering, should I take the screw out of it or just put the screw back? Yeah, that's just the spacer. Okay, so my coffee yeah. is an excellent thing to have achieved, Bo. Congratulations. Mm, coffee. And I'm just basically trying to make sure that I don't put <laughs> too much pressure on it, if that makes sense. Yep. Yeah, I'm just having a hard time lining it back up. So I'm wondering if I should have taken it entirely out. Yeah, it's, it's a lot easier if you take it the whole way out. That's... I think you might have to, depending on the rig. Yeah, I'm just struggling with uh, getting it fully in back aligned on the motherboard. Yeah, the tiny little screws are the worst. I'm just like, oh god, why? Also, let me... All right, one NVMe almost down, because the the two terabyte is just gonna have the OS and uh like Office on it, and then the four terabyte is gonna have the games that require being on uh, SSD, so it will actually play quickly and load quickly. I just it blows me away how big NVMe's have gotten. And how you're basically going to be running a machine with six terabytes of NVMe drive. And you did not pay the earth for those items. Yeah, it's wild to me because like my 10 terabyte that's going to come from my other machine did cost me the earth, you know. Yeah. I mean, even just like five years ago. A four terabyte NVMe would have been like, yeah, no, I, I can build a whole computer for the cost of that one card. All right. Why are you being so difficult? 
So this is where I struggle for half the stream. All right, entertain yourselves while I struggle bus with this. Remember that is 90% of PC building is the struggle bus thing and then the realizing when you put it all together that you put a fan in backwards and you have to disassemble a bunch of shit to get back to that one. And you know what I did? I took a picture before I took the fans out. Excellent plan. Yeah, I'm just trying to... This this sounds like, you know, forethought, forethought and planning, which is an entirely alien concept to me. I cannot comprehend. Yeah, I'm just trying to get this... Like, I'm not able to... So I'm afraid I'm just going to break this fucking thing, you know? It's also not entirely... <laughs> Yeah, I'm just like, God damn it. So basically, I'm just struggling to line this up. So while I struggle <laughs> to do this. Oh, Kiro, Spuddy. Oh, you heard that? Yeah. There's a pupper. Yeah, he is. Why, why is he crying? Because he wants attention. I mean, he sounds like the saddest dog to ever dog. Yeah, that's how he uh, he gets away with it. He's manipulative, little fuck. <laughs> wow. <laughs> One second. I mean, he knows I'm a sucker and I'll fall for every single time. I mean, yeah, that's that's usually how it works. Angel Baby's the same mm -hmm. way. He just looks at me and goes, meow. And I'm like, yeah, okay, whatever you want, cat. It's fine. Exactly, Lady Luck, right? The worst life is freeloaders. Well, the, the big problem is now, <laughs> I think I sent this to the group chat, that my neighbor's cat has realized that I'm a sucker and will occasionally just stand outside and howl until I go and give him attention. And is now, because the house has a, uh, a cat door built into it. Oh. And he is now, yeah. that he'll just, you know, what's up? You have he's a cat now, dude. <laughs> I mean, it's my neighbor's cat. Like, he has a collar and everything. And it's... Oh, you mean your the neighbor's Elaine. cat just came in and made itself at home? Uh huh. Because I mean, the cat is how they do. Yeah. Uh, I just saw your reply, Mandy. Sorry about that. It's like that cat, motherfucker. All right. And you know what just startled me was a fucking political text. Oh, was it like a fundraising thing or? I feel like I have gotten 20 of those texts in one day. All right, I do have a spare if I can't find the other one, but Jesus Christ. That, like, it startled me enough to drop what I was doing. So I'm looking... Hey, for... Xander. Hey, Xander. Welcome in. How are you? I'm struggle... I'm struggle-bussing to, uh... To get this one screw back in the PC. As the saying goes, I truly have a screw loose. Hello, how is the rest of Zelda? Alright. I feel like maybe I should have done this part first. Alright, come on. Come on. Come on. Did we get it? That looks like a possibility. Ooh, it looks like it's bending, though. Bending the NVMe? Yes. All right, so only tighten until it looks flat. See, I, I took it out, and then it popped. Then it, uh... Ah, fuck me. Yeah, I saw it. I was I was lurking till I decided to come and try to do this. Yeah, I might just take this gray thing out. I'm not sure how it's gonna work otherwise. So silly question: Does it need the plastic to ground it? No, no, the gray thing is not needed. Okay, so I might try to take the gray thing off. Um, but yeah, uh, can I get a shout out for Xander? Oh, you already got it. Yeah. I already got you on that one. <laughs> oh, this might not. I read come your off. mind. <laughs> okay, this may not come off. 
the the gray plastic bit may not come off because I feel like it should so I don't think there's actually enough give on this for it to go between the little plastic can you zoom in on the plastic thingy again Yeah, I don't think there's enough give, but it looked like I was bending the NVMe, which is why I unscrewed it, even though I just... Yeah, you should. I'm pretty sure you need to take that off. I don't know how. Hmm. Um, where's the motherboard directions? Right here. All right, so while I struggle to do this, how's everyone doing? Okay, so M2 slots. It is not telling me how to do this. All right, we may have to, I may have to do a YouTube and hope that they've got captions rather than making me listen to some dude drone on. Well, I just hate when it's like, I'm going to spend 20 minutes explaining this thing when I could have just told you what it was. Oh yeah, but you got to get the, uh, the, the video of you count up. Got to get the, those watch hours in. I guess. Um, I'm going to drop this thing and lose it at some point because, okay, that actually goes with this. Nope, that doesn't fit there. I was going to try to use a different screw, but I don't think that's going to work. Xander, have you and Pirate hung out since I was out there? Uh, no, we've only met like the one time that you were out here. So that little plastic piece won't come off for you? I cannot get it off, no. Mm. Let me check something. I'll be right back. I realize as I said that, that you're asking Xander and not me, but yeah, I'm right here. Well, I know, but you both, I mean, you're both here, so. Mm. Yeah, I'm just having a moment of why won't this fucking gray thing come off this screw? And I'm guessing, I'm guessing this is supposed to be more like a lip to go over the end of the NVMe. I wonder, I'm going to actually do a thing. I'm going to put this back in here. This may not, because I think the screw itself. Okay, so I'm going to try something. Nope, that is, and I put it in the wrong spot. Anyway, fuck. Sorry, y'all. I know this is not particularly exciting to watch me struggle bus with this, but it is going to bother me. And I need to fix it anyway so I can actually put the hard drive in. Which is weird to me to say that that's a hard that drive. That is an important thing. I know this is just really bugging me. <clears throat> okay, so. I'm gonna try one more thing and if this doesn't work, I may be a little stumped or I may need to go check YouTube. Yeah, that's not gonna work either. Cause there's no way to, there's no way to do that with that screw on the board there's no way to put that actually on the board with the screw on fuck but, uh, okay i'm back um right. it doesn't look like i have spacers on any of my nvme um so basically put the black thing back Is what you're no, saying. like you need to to get the little plastic piece off the screw. Mm -hmm. 
or if the black piece will screw directly into there. I don't know where, like some of them, that's the way they're built is like the black piece will screw directly into it. Nope, it's longer than that. Okay. Mm. Nope. I mean, that's where the other one goes. Mm-hmm. But. Do you have, like, a regular screwdriver that you can kind of pop that little plastic piece off of that screw? Oh, well, that's what I've been trying to do with the tiny uh, flathead. i just been failing. Mm. You know what? Keep talking. I'm going to get, I'm going to get uh, nail clippers and see if that works. Oh, that is, that's a good idea. Yeah, that little, that's a good job. Hey, look, I didn't spend all the years struggling. It's just goofy, like, why is this piece of plastic on here if you have to cut it off anyway? Yeah, I don't know. But it seems like it's if it's causing a problem with making the NVMe lay flat, you definitely don't want that. Yeah, I'm basically going to try to clip enough with the nail clippers where I can pull it off. Or at least pop this open with the nail clippers. Like, get out of there. Anyway, while I struggle with this, how's everyone doing? You know, I didn't actually say that I was live. <laughs> Oops. Well, yeah. yeah, I I honestly like have serious doubts as to how much that actually helps because you know social media algorithms they they're bastards. True. All right, this may have been a good shout, but it is. This thing is really fucking wedged all around the this uh, screw. I have oh, wow. no idea how to get this off. And other screws are going to be too big. Yeah, it's interesting to me that it's like not just popping off. And maybe I'm just weak. Because I no, can't it, even pry, I can't pry the two ends open enough for the screw to... God, motherfucker. Sorry. Do not damage yourself. I didn't, but I heard the screw drop, and now I don't know where it went. Okay. So it's either on top of this container under my table, or it fell in this box full of Minthara, which sounds weird. <laughs> but I primed No, that's, that's awesome. And mm -hmm. she's under the table in this box. Oh, hello, Raiders. Welcome in to the, the raid from Trisha Hushberger. Hey, we Trish. We have a raid popping in. Working and trying to wake up, documenting telephony systems, needs more coffee. Yeah, that's complicated and needs all the caffeine in the world. Hey, Trish, how are you? I, If you were at TwitchCon, I sadly miss seeing you. I hope you are well. Uh, you've arrived um, as I'm trying to struggle bus to uh, build a computer. A awesome t Jory. Hey, you know congrats, how, Jory. Yeah, you know how you hear something hit the ground and you couldn't say where the fuck it just landed? That would be me right yep. now. This is the reason why I will never again put rugs or carpets in any room that I do the mini builds in. Uh, it's going, okay. Trish. I'm currently trying to get the NVMe to lay flat. And I'm failing miserably. So I've been sitting here literally for like 15 minutes trying to get this NVMe to lay flat. And now I'm now I'm stuck using the spare screw for the NVMe. So I am stumped. I may just need to uh, pull up a YouTube video really quick. Uh, and look up my motherboard. I'm like, how do I do this? Oh, <laughs> kitty. All right, so let's just Google installing NVMe on this motherboard. Oh no, Nolly, not losing a needle. 
on B. And clearly, what you need to do for the cat is get one of those like the 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 sort of like body pillow esque things that they sell at the anime cons with with the with the the creepy giant tits on them and buy that as a as a bed for the cat for the to to make it up for it. They're like, no, 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 this isn't for me. This is for my cat. Oh my god, why is there always a video? Mm -hmm. And YouTube struggling. I may have to go in the other room and let you all chat amongst yourselves. Oh, the mouse pads. Yes, exactly. Yeah, YouTube's struggling on my laptop right now, so... Bro, I don't care. Okay. So it looks like maybe for this one, that little plastic thing is actually just the lock that like you put the screw in like most of the way and then you turn the little plastic thing to like keep it in place. Okay. It's like an Ikea cabinet. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just looking at this video. It's like, dude, I don't care about your like hit like and subscribe. Yes. Hey, Melissa. Hey, Melissa. I will be there in a second. Okay, it looks like, see, the the motherboard he has, the screws, see, he didn't screw the second screw in. He left that mm -hmm. screw there and just put the, uh, oh, no, I was wrong. Are you feeling in a bit of a violent mood, Sirius? Serious? Are you okay? Drop kick that button. Stab the like. <laughs> oh my God! Are you are you okay? <laughs> Bye, Trish. Have a good one. Sleep well. Thanks everyone for hanging out while we struggle bust through. Uh... See the the video I just found. It is a very tiny screw. It is not the same screw I've got. Mm. It looks like a screw that came with the NVMe, and not. Uh... Yeah, that is a normal screw for a uh, NVMe drive. It is not. It is not the screw that I'm trying to use. Hey Tom. Hey Tom. So yeah, he. It looks like whoever this guy is, he absolutely did screw it in, but it's a regular screw. Hmm. It's not this weird. Has the. So. Case I found on. a video. Hang on. Let Hi, everyone. This is what we do now, apparently. So do you still have the little plastic guy screw, or did he get lost in the box? I, I, I had to open the spare, but I've got one. Okay. So um, I'm sending this to you. Uh, Sorry, y'all. I know this is probably not super exciting, copy. but I'm a fail mm -hmm. today. And people come to, especially for a just chatting stream. People come for the company, not the not the excitement. And the company is top tier as always. Oh well, thank you. Okay, so okay, this dude's arm is okay. Whoever this is needs some lotion. Okay, he is so far away from the camera, though. But basically, it looks like the the little plastic piece. You just kind of like turn it until the the um, NVMe kind of gets locked by it. Right, but even screwing it in enough to stay in the motherboard seemed like I was bending the NVMe. Hmm. All right, I'm gonna try it again. Let's see what happens. Hey Tom, how are you? Apparently, Surya is this feeling violent toward a. Yeah, I mean, fishing in the video game is enough to make anybody stabby, based on my experiences. So I fully, fully understand this. Okay, so. Oh, you fucking screw. So Hi. maybe take the um, NVMe out, put the screw back in. But I wasn't able to. Until... Oh, oh, it didn't I fit? See... No, unless. Hold on. 
hold that thought because it looked like he still had the the screw out unless I was so now we'll know for the other one mm -hmm. all right get in there I mean I'm glad this is a magnetic screwdriver because Jesus Christ this is one of those things where I'm like, I wish there was more standardization between various things because it's like, mm -hmm. I've never seen one with a little plastic turny thing. I've always just put a plain old screw right on in there. Same. All right. So what I'm going to do is put this back and then just turn that. And if that's all it is, I'm going to fucking yell. Not in your ear, though, because you're both on chat with me. But I'll <laughs> fucking yell about it later. Yeah, I can't turn the thingy. Oh, I'm sorry, Sirius. That's that back at it again. Then, Sirius has had a long going saga with a neighbor I'm whose relationship needed to end a very long time ago. <laughs> and I want to come over and beat the shit out of those people. They have been annoying you, mm -hmm. Mr. Sirius, for as long as I've <clears throat> known you all, I feel like. Uh. All right, fuck it. It's in there. It's staying. Yay, Victor V. The law. Yeah. I mean, we can roll up with a posse, serious. I'm just saying. I mean, <laughs> Kelly's tall and thinks she's intimidating. I, I have swords. So do I. I just can't fly with them. <laughs> but you can drive. There. I don't need to fly. I'm pretty sure I could drive to where Sirius is, right? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not going to let the, the subtle shade there go past that Kelly thinks she's intimidating. She <laughs> does. It's adorable. <laughs> Kelly, is, Kelly is intimidating if you don't know Kelly. Touche, touche. Yeah. <laughs> okay, put it this way. To me, Kelly will never be intimidating. Yes. Uh-huh. Yeah, that's fair. And yeah, for her, she I, will have I do jousting, so I have swords that can actually cut things. Yeah. I just, it's it's amusing to me because Kelly, oh, wait, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to take the uh, back. And have a sharp. I feel like Kelly's <laughs> just going to show up. You'd be like, it's your anniversary, get out of this chat. I mean, I have sword short enough to travel with that can go in a check bag. I'm just saying. Yeah, I mean, like, you can put anything in a check bag. That's how I got a kukri back from, uh, from Australia. Nice. It was so funny. I tweeted about buying a kukri because I was very excited that I found a kukri. Mm -hmm. Why did half of my fucking followers going you can't bring that home i'm like i'm not gonna get on the plane with it in my hand i'm not walking through the metal detector guys <laughs> and i'm just like y'all need to go outside i beg of you all right nvme number two now that we know what we're doing now that we have solved the confusing strangeness of your particular boards exactly Oh my god, Carrie, why are you awake? Not that I'm not glad to see you, but why are you awake? Isn't it tomorrow for you, but just barely? <laughs> uh, it should be 1.30 a.m. Yeah, just barely tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, Melissa, it was just like people felt very sure in messaging me and going, you can't take that on the plane. And I was like, please show me where I said I'm going to try to take this on a plane with me. Please explain. All right. Now that I know what I'm doing, I'm just going to open this one. This is the four terabyte NVMe, by the way. You know, I just realized I don't have a monitor 
to make sure this boots once I have the... Oh, there. Well, I've got a monitor, but I have to take apart my work setup. <laughs> or I'd have to... See, I'd have to disconnect one of my monitors and bring it in here. And because it's on a monitor arm, I no longer have the stand for it or couldn't at least tell you where it is. My work setup... That may be Saturday. I may have to take my work monitor off. Yes. Hi, Carrie. It is Taru and Pirate. It's Amy. Yes. I get to see Carrie soon. Uh, and hopefully she does not murder me because we're sharing a hotel room for MCM. <laughs> oh, fun. I say that. I doubt that Carrie and I would murder each other. Huh. Interesting, Ferwick. I know that you can, swords, as long as they are sheathed, you're allowed to travel with them. And also, um, strangely enough, like pitchforks, as long as the tines are covered, you can pitchforks? travel with them. Well, I know this, this because is... I throw sheaf for Highland Games, which is a pitchfork. This is also very contextual in where you're traveling to. That's true. Because all of this is, is true within the U.S. Domestically, but the UK yes. has UK has very different knife laws. So, like, if you're traveling through the U.K., that might be a much bigger problem than anything else. That's fair. Yeah. Yup. Huzzah. Yeah, I think probably the most dangerous item that I own is my sheaf fork. It is so sharp. You motherfucker! Not you. Look at this bullshit. It went right is in. Is it not going? No, oh, <laughs> it, it went right in. Motherfucker. We have learned, and now we know. <laughs> Katana sales? Oh, okay. Yep. Katana mm -hmm. sales, yeah. No, I just had yeah. a moment of that motherfucker just went right in. Right in. Like a glove. I'm actually surprised that Katana sales weren't already banned under the existing knife laws. That feels like something that is a strange thing to not already have included in that. Oof, yeah. Hi, everyone. I thought you think it's all back to the US and Japan. Yeah, they have fun with customs on that, Furwick. Or honestly, it's probably less of a problem than going the opposite direction. I mean, when I came back from Australia, the kukri was in a sheath, in a box, wrapped up. I had a receipt and certificate that I'd bought it there, that I wasn't just, I wasn't a fucking axe murderer, you know? All right, NVMEs are in. We did it. Woohoo. All right, next up is the rant. Should I do the C? I should probably do the CPU, huh? Well, shit. CPU, where are you? Yes, I'm calling the CPU because I moved the box. Oh, the box is right in front of me. Uh, this is a Ryzen 9. AM5 CPU. Yeah. So pretty. Yeah. Alright, AMD. Also, hashtag I am an AMD partner, but they did not provide any of this. I bought this all myself. Mm -hmm. Uh what do you mean? Melissa. Oh, this thing's kind of hefty for a CPU. Also, where's the corner? Oh, no, man, that the, is a beast. It's actually kind of heavy. And has a certificate of authenticity. And I'm like, can you give me instructions? Oh, can we it? successfully got both of the NVMEs in. 
Aha! AMD Red Team. I'm part of the Red Team, but you didn't give me any of this shit for free. <laughs> I shouldn't say that. They have sent me two PCs. It's not their fault that one suffered from power surges. Okay. AM5 CPU. Oh, there's a socket frame? All right, let me make sure I'm doing this properly. Okay, it says socket frame, but... Oh, this is the socket frame. Now, this is the part where... I'm out... Huh? I'm just now dwelling on the what. what is the classification of a zombie knife. Is it a dead knife? Probably any, like, fantasy-style knife with, like, lots of serrations. <laughs> Okay, so silly question because I don't see where the where the thingies go. Like, where do the, the pins go in? Because there's no place for pins to sink into. You gotta pop the top. This one. The little, like. I did pop it. Oh yeah. I, I, oh, you got to get the little plastic guy off, I think. Uh, I'm trying to figure out how, like. I'm doing the, I don't want to fuck up where the CPU goes. Because the uh, triangle's actually right there. Mm. Ah, ha ha. Aha, uh -huh, pop the top. There we go. They're going to stress me the fuck out. So, Anything can be a zombie knife if you believe in yourself. <laughs> so this corner goes there. Yep. Whew. All right. Breathe deep, deep breath. Usa. <laughs> All right. It, it's in. Because the corners match. All right. This is the part where... We all pray. Okay, hold on. Okay, that's flush. Uh, this is where we all pray and hope that this... Okay, there we go. It was not... Um... We did it! Hey! And that, now that comes off. Now yep. the CPU's in there. Yep, it pops it off as it goes through. Whew, okay, CPU's in. The hardest part is done beside the water cooler. The liquid hey. cooler. Let's see, serious. That's where my mind was going. It's like, is, is it the knife <laughs> itself is a zombie? Is it a knife used by zombies? Like, there's, there's so many potential interpretations that have so much interest. interesting uh I feel like Potential. it's those very specific, like, they got, like, the little slots cut out of them. And they have a lot of, like, serrations on them. And they're usually, like, ridiculous looking. I knew if that... All right, it's, like, if... halfway between, like, a machete and a, I don't know, multi-tool. Okay, so this is going to annoy the fuck out of me. Why is there this much foam in this fucking box? Why? Uh, it's an excellent question. They make a point of telling you there's no cooler in it, right? This, this I guess maybe fine. they want to only make one box and one carries a cooler and one doesn't. I don't know. A cooler wouldn't fit in here. Oh, that's true. Never mind. My brain is just like... They just want to be part of the Cool Kids Club. <laughs> well, I'm going to assume that the, the legitimate reason is because parcel services are notoriously not delicate with things. Ah, uh, yes. And sure. CPU pins are fragile as fuck. Alright, but we got the CPU in. Please clap, because we did it. Um, and we're doing better on time than I expected, because I thought I w I'd be struggle busing a lot more. And we were at first hey. with the NVMEs, so... The now very tedious part of... Uh, Oh, I can put this fan back. 
this fan gets to go back in. And remember what I said, I took a picture. This side was facing out. Mm -hmm. The Corsair was facing in. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to put the memory in. I'm just wondering, should I wait until the very end to put in the cooling or not? I would recommend waiting until the very end, just because I think it's easier to it's then bulky. snake it around everything else. Yeah. Yeah. I guess, Nolly, but it just it just bothers me from a waste standpoint. <laughs> because all of that foam is under the CPU. If someone threw that hard enough... It would absolutely. And I just feel like it would be a pain in the ass either way. Okay, this was here. So how's everyone doing? Oh, gotta, gotta remember these are magnetic and I need to use that. So I will actually have a case uh, left when I, after I take the, basically I will have a PC left over minus hard drives and a GPU when all of this is said and done. If there's anyone who needs a computer, but you got to come get this shit. <laughs> well, I mean, it's got windows on it and I can yeah. wipe it and without, and honestly, I've got the 7900. AMD sent me because when I did that giveaway they gave me one and then I had one that I had to ship out yay what's for food Mandy oh I did this backwards not backwards but the other uh, the other screw holes are not visible nice I finally got groceries today. They arrived like a half hour before I started the stream. So dinner what dinner was a uh, a fruit bowl because that's all I felt like cooking, or that's all I felt like having. Um, and yes, I will freely admit part of this is because of Veilguard. Oh, the this. upgrade to make sure you can run it. I was gonna say I was gonna tell Sirius to report back. Report back what? Oh, yeah, yeah. She's being, she's going to go be nosy with the ear against the wall. Uh, with the neighbor? Yeah. Yeah, but I actually bought the stuff to make nachos. If this doesn't, if I'm done soon enough, I may cook tonight. I don't know. Absolutely. I mean, you're not wrong. All right, so the two NVMEs are in. Um, so put those aside. Oh, and I've got a wrist strap. I haven't even opened it. I'm the worst at this. But honestly, when was the last time we actually needed those? Because I feel like building computers has gotten so much better. You don't need to be that big of a risk with a static, static shock. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Also, you can put this motherboard box away. Mm, veggies. I did eat, I swear, but I'm still hungry. <laughs> so, I mean, we've talked about this, but part of my problem is um, a lack of appetite due to some of the medication I'm now on. So, that sucks. Memory. So is your board a uh, two and f two and four or one and three? Uh, there's four slots, so two and four. Yeah, yeah, but they usually recommend you put them in specific setups depending on how many sticks you have. Um, or do I you have all four? No, I only bought two 32 gig sticks. Okay. I'm gonna look at the. Uh... We're gonna read the instructions again. Maybe. Imagine that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I 
Combining the above messages, we get roasted veggie nachos, which are in fact delicious. That sounds delicious. Mm-hmm. So this is the same I had memory. It just went faster. This is literally double the bus speed of the RAM in my current machine. That's wild. Yeah. So I don't know if you remember, Taru, when I tried to put uh, 128 gigs in my current machine and almost bricked it. When you when you borked it because it was like, no, I can't do it. <laughs> it's too much, Captain. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Whatever that is, don't break. Fireworks for no reason? Unacceptable. Have uh, fun. Okay, why are you not popping open? Why? Oh, do only, there's only one side open? Huh. They I should just, both open. They should. Hey. It doesn't look like they, they can, not? actually. Interesting. Where's all the nail clippers? I just managed to break a nail. Oh no, I broke a nail while doing non girly things. What will I do? <laughs> Fireworks? There's like literally no reason right now. It's October. Sorry for the noise, but. I managed to break a nail somehow, even though my nails are struggling to grow back. Fun fact I didn't know. Getting a gel manicure too often will soften your nails and make them weak. Which I did not know. I can't see vengeance without thinking about Dragon Age, though. Which, uh, Jory... So this is also going to be weird because it'll be an all Corsair case at this point. Which way does this go? I like when everything matches. It makes me happy. Yeah, my current case is very much a hodgepodge of... All right. Why are we like this? Come on. Yeah, this this side does not move at all. That is interesting. Hmm. Huh. Well. Oh, it's also facing the wrong way. Huh. Well, this is a dilemma. Oh, no, nope, there we go. There is that satisfying snap. Oh, it's so good when they snap into place. <laughs> Jory, are you okay? I feel like we're traumatizing Jory. But it says vengeance for the Dragon Age fans, which I didn't do on purpose, but... Oh, my own stream said no. Are you still there? Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, no, I got an error 3000. Yeah, I got indeed. a decoder error on my own stream. Oh, fun. Yeah, I've been no, getting everything is Everything is good. Yeah, I've been getting it randomly when I watch streams, like when I've got people up during the workday. I will, mm -hmm. I'll, I'll suddenly just not hear anything, and I'm like, the fuck and it'll be like er decoder error or um mm, that's not right <laughs> rowan's like breathe breathe jory breathe <laughs> Come on. Why are you being so difficult, you fucking ramstick? This is what being in a car with me is like, too, as pirate can attest. I do also just enjoy that sounding like a general insult. Like, you fucking ramstick. You fucking ramstick. <laughs> 
Well, I'm like, what was it? I was reading the other day. There was like, you like switch up your curses, and it was like, um, you pile of fucks and go shit yourself. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Instead of you know like a pile of shit and go fuck yourself, so just switch them up, and things get way more interesting. <laughs> There we go. There's the click. All right. So now I'm going to set this up and I'm trying to figure out the best way for this to work. Because I need to. So the fans I took out of the top to make room for the liquid cooler need to go there. I'm trying to figure out how to show that without hitting the camera slash showing the entire disaster that is my dining room right now but you may just get you may just get some uh dining room disaster that's just usually the re reference of the meat cooking what <laughs> dining room disaster my attempt my attempts at cooking you did a whole cooking son of a fuck yep it's a good one i burned myself repeatedly but the uh, the the, uh, the the cooking thing helped because it meant I had to I was forced to focus on it and couldn't go full ADHD brain and forget that I had a thing on the stove. And you were also in the stove for the duration. Which is my of... usual problem. Ah, uh, hey, I have left many. I have I have sometimes forgotten about the stove, but it has a timer, and it's loud as fuck. See, this is based on the the assumption that you remembered to set the timer. That I usually do, because I will set the timer, and it's usually 30 or 40 minutes, and or I'll do a backup timer on my phone, because mm -hmm. I know myself. Well, I now have it embroidered, thanks to Chris and Kelly, son of an Antivan <clears throat> horror. Mm-hmm. This is going to be heavy as fuck once everything's in here. Uh, what can you all see right now? Um, oh, fuck. I'd say... The back of the case. The back of the case. Pretty much. Well, that fell off. Well, that's what I want you to see because I'm going to put fans in here. What What fell off? Uh, this. I mean, it was a connected to something, but I just stepped... I almost just stepped on it. Ah. So it's... It is one of the USB 3 connectors. I'm just yes. not sure where it fell off from. But mm. I stepped on it. All right. So, where are those? Where are the two fans that I took out earlier? Because now it's... There's a bunch of shit all over. Because I've got extra cables for when everything finally goes in there thermal paste excellent oh yeah my Aver media card which can go in so funny story i have two Aver media cards um one has two inputs one has one input oh. they sent me one and i had bought one way before i was an Aver media partner and i had had it so long i could not return it so if anyone needs a internal card, just tell me. You may get one in the mail. Oh, hey, uh, cord things. And more screws. Motherfucker. Sorry. I keep yelling motherfucker because I keep finding random shit. So these are the fans I took out. I don't know what to do. Should I buy another fan? Because there's three slots, but only two fans. I mean, I would see what temps your computer's rocking once you have this set up. And if it's fine with the fans that you've got, I don't think you're going to need more, more than that. Like, I don't have nearly as many fans as what you're going to be rocking. And my system right now, like, is chilling pretty, pretty cool. Well, like, I also... Barely... Uh, 60 degrees Celsius. Yeah. Well, part of the problem with... Um, part of the problem with... The... Um, 
Oh my god, what is the word I'm looking for? With the card I initially got, the 7900 XTX, it was running for a while at ridiculous temperatures. Like, how have I not fried myself alive by sitting next to this machine? Okay. Temperatures. Uh, it how many it has three fans for itself? Uh so the actual card or the case it's in currently? The card. Okay. One second. Let me know what you're seeing. I just realized. Uh I'm trying. <laughs> oh, you can see the Lego that I haven't put together. Uh, <laughs> Legos. Yeah. Um I was gonna put in this card. Oh, I somehow like what what temps were was your card running at? Uh, for a hot minute, literally. Oh my god, how am I on everyone's channel but my own? I somehow managed to like tab away to Brian's channel. He's not even live. Um. Uh, I was concerned because I was getting like eighty Celsius, and when I put in a ticket, they're like can be up to 95 celsius and it's fine and i was like what yeah i was like yeah are you for real like for really real yeah they basically so that particular model has a tendency to get really toasty um and it's something that they know and they're saying like if it's creeping up towards like 90 it's okay it's when you start seeing numbers of like 100 110 that you're supposed to like call them and then they'll get you a replacement yeah but it was the fact that they were just so sanguine about it could be up to 95 celsius yeah no totally <laughs> terrifying i was like, like muskezy what y'all y'all said celsius are, are yeah. we for real right now yep okay so this is where i might fuck up it does seem high it's so I also had that panic when I initially set up this particular machine. I upgraded a lot of stuff, my MOBO, CPU, um, graphics card, and some RAM all at the same time. Um, and I went with the newer CPU and an AMD uh, graphics card as well. And like, you know, when it was under load, it was sitting at like 80 degrees, 85 degrees. And I was like, ooh, that's high. And then I went online and I started checking and everything said, Nope, that's just the way these cards are. They tend to run a little bit hotter. And unless you're seeing like these really wildly high numbers, you're probably okay as long as it isn't all the time. Yeah, but I was like mildly concerned. Oh, I don't know. There could be a fucking fire hazard. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and there's like. Well, and you were using mechanical cooling on that system, right? Oh, uh, yeah. This will be the first time I'm yeah. using liquid. Because they were just so sanguine about it. They're like, oh, no, nah, it's fine. I was like, this thing's going to fucking cook me. <laughs> I could cook eggs on this. Yeah, so I was, I was moderately concerned by the just lack of... Yeah, that's, that's high. And I'm like, what? All right, you may be getting an extreme close-up because I did not realize the camera would be that fucking close to the case. Yeah, coffee warmer. Yeah, just stick your stick your coffee on top of your computer. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, not a bug. It's a feature. Mm -hmm. But I was like, I just was concerned because I'm like, if just the GPU is this fucking hot. All right. I also move this back just a little bit because then we need to start connecting things and I need to put well I can't put the well I can put the basics in here the what I've got left to do is the hard drive kit enclosure but I can't do that until I'm ready to take the hard drives out of the act the other machine and I think I can put two in here so I've got two SATAs and I've got a couple SSDs that are going to go there. So let's see if I can t lay this on the other side and just put these fans, put these fans in the rest of the way. Oh, Shiza, how's this going to go in? Okay. 
It's also got its own little Corsair control thingy. This the right way? I think so. We'll know in a minute. Nope, that is not the right way. Dude, you would be rich if you build a cooler unit that makes coffee. I'm about that. Seriously? Like, I would help. I'd buy that fucker. Right? All right, this is where I have to lean into the camera. Because I had to disconnect, the, like, literally disconnect the fans. Well, I just realized... Where are those other two fans going to connect to? Well, shit. Because this only has room for one more fan. At least through this controller. This is the RGB hub and the mm -hmm. fan. Because I have two more fans I have to go back with the liquid cooling. Oh, are all your fans RGB? That's fun. Uh, No, the ones that came with the cooler aren't. So actually this works out because this is this one in the bag is the one that came with the uh with the liquid cooler. Yeah, for sure, Carrie. Uh fan setup is key um when you're playing with AMD. It tends to run a little bit more toasty than your Intel builds. But they can also handle it, which is the other side of it. Like I'm pretty sure that the graphics card that you have, the 79 XTX has like a limit of up to like 110 degrees Celsius, which I mean, back in the day, that would have more than fried anything else. Oh, 200%. Because that's why I was so concerned because again, I'm, I'm an old bastard where I'm like, that's a lot of heat on my computer. That's a scary number. Especially <laughs> Why is there not about... fire? <laughs> Mandy, what? Only fans? Yeah. Yeah, we're talking about the fans. Only fans. Oh my god. <laughs> Why am I friends with you two? I don't know. <sighs> fire! Yeah. The, the history of poor life choices. Well, considering my previous relationship before Eric, that is not wrong. Mandy, you always hear fire. Mandy just wants to cause a fire, I think. Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, shit, you know what I did? <laughs> what did you do? I didn't take the plastic off of the motherboard here. Before I set it in the case. You know the little film on the very back? Oh. Um, I, I didn't take that off. Well, shit. And everything's in here Fire now. and pet dangerous animals. <laughs> well. Don't pet the fire. Yeah, that's that's usually not recommended. Yeah, don't don't pet the really? fire, Mandy. No, if I if I ever wind up DMing a game that Mandy's in, I'm absolutely I'm fired. going to make a fire elemental that is an adorable friend shape. Oh, you would, wouldn't you? <laughs> yeah, absolutely would. Is this to get her back for uh, setting you on fire? But there's that one photo of the surface of the sun where it looks fluffy. What? Huh? Like the the actual burn you to a crisp if you ever really touched it, son. My fire demon, so I can cuddle the fire. I mean, I was saying this, and and you know, just flashing back to Mandy's pet in the Motherlands game. <laughs> oh, her <Herbola>. yeah, <laughs> yeah. Accidental fires, say what? <laughs> yeah, her Volca, that was... What was the creature from classic Star Trek that uh, looked like a pizza, but it, like, left fire behind? 
Does anyone know what the fuck I'm talking about? Yeah, it's from, oh man. Yeah, Spock oh, mind dude. melded with it? Yeah, um. Did they have a name? I don't remember. Honestly. But I know what you're talking about. It looked like, like, like a pizza rock. Yes. That is what and, I'm thinking of. Yeah. And then they were like, oh, shoot. You know exactly oh my what gosh. I'm talking about, don't you? Uh-huh. And I'm thinking. Was it a Volca? No, Horta. Horta, okay. W was it a Horta? H-O-R. Yeah. Okay. Whew. Can keep my nerd card. <laughs> See, I I don't know what I don't know what you're talking about, but Look, my my brain instead is going to the old like episode of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles cartoon where they had basically the xenomorph from Aliens, but they were made out of pizza. Yeah. <laughs> yes. The what? Yes. It's it's literally that you take yes, a pizza story. and it, it straight up turned into the xenomorph. Only it was still uh, pizza. Yes, Brian. We're talking about the Horta. Horta or Horka. I don't remember exactly. But all I remember the, is... The little angry pizza rocks. Yes. And it turned out it was a mother. And uh, Spock had mind meld with it. I didn't have to, but he did. Okay. Okay, where are the chords for this one? Ah. But yeah, Mandy would totally have a angry fire pizza rock as a pet. Mm -hmm. I mean, she kind of did in the Volca. That's true. <laughs> I am now so very sad that I cannot do the noise that Eugenio made for that thing. I am not sad, just so you know. <laughs> I, yeah, this is fair. I am not sad that you cannot make that fucking noise. Because, oof. Now, this is where I need to look up the instructions and see exactly... What I am connecting to what? This is my one gripe with, with modern uh, computer cases. I've also got to stick the PSU in here. Mm -hmm. And and the uh, CPU or yeah, the, not CPU. The case for the for the drives. And that's what those are. I need to not lose them. Um. All right. So here's where you watch me read a manual and try not to fuck this up. Because if you fuck up these connections, it'll be real bad. Or right. you just think your computer doesn't work when really you plug the power button into the wrong place. Oh, That one. has never happened. Never in a million years <laughs> at all. So see, it says reset switch on it. This is your reset mm -hmm. switch. This is where you plug this in. Um... Uh, but they actually, they were doing a uh, Star Trek trivia at the um, con I was at. And there was some really obscure shit where I'm sitting there thinking, I know Star Trek. I ain't no shit compared to some of these people. I was just yeah. Like, yeah, dedicated Trek trivia at a Trek con. That's going to go, that's got some deep cuts in that. Also terrifying, like... It'd there be was... like in the twelfth minute of the fifth episode. Yeah. Yeah, like and you're like, huh? What? <laughs> Basically. 
And I'm sitting there going, I don't know shit. It's like, I thought I knew, but it turns out I don't. There was some stuff where I was just sitting there going, I grew up watching Star Trek. I remember seeing the movie in the theater, and I don't know anything. Okay, what did I do with the instruction manual? Many, many, many Star Trek shows. Especially if you have Paramount Plus. Oh, Sirius has tea. Ooh. Sirius, do you mean... Oh, okay, see, so I was going to ask. Do you mean as in the liquid tea or you have been listening to your neighbors and you have the tea? See, I'm uh, the second one I was really hoping for. <laughs> I assumed with with the way that you sang song Tia, I figured that's what you were you were also assuming that she meant, yeah. So I still don't have the it right could well be both though, like yeah. PCIE slot for this fucking thing. This is irritating. Huh? So this is the two slot HDMI or this is the two slot capture card. Uh -huh. I don't have the right kind of PCIe slot on this fucking board, and this is a new board. I'm confused. Hang on. Because that one, I think, is for the GPU. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know what this is covering. I don't think uh, I'm supposed that to That might be off. another NVMe card spot. Oh. I know I have one there. Well. All right, so... Unless that is the one at the bottom. Is the one at the bottom for that? Mm. But that's, look at how big the slot is versus this. Because this is a four, this is the Live Gamer Duo. Huh. I have never used one of those. I apologize. I don't know. No, it's fine. I bought it, and then it was one of those things of, I bought it, I bought it, I meant to use it, didn't use it. It's too late to send it back. And then I'm like, oh, it's a new computer. Surely this will fit in this motherboard. I was wrong. Unless that slot at the bottom is for it. And I'm like, but that doesn't seem like the right fit. Like, why is that spot so big? Yeah. So PCIe 16. So hang on, PCIe PCIe PCI Express. These are both PCIe Express 16. Hmm. Well. All right. First, let's figure. Oh fuck. I need a pedicure. I know that was random. Okay. I'm also looking here to see what goes where. I think one of these. Goes Do you only have one graphics card slot on that motherboard? Uh, that one, I think. Huh. Because unless I want to crack open that, uh, also want to crack open that 7900. I mean, running dual. Graphics cards is a lot. Oh, I'm not putting dual graphics cards in here. All right. PCIe. It says a PCIe 5.0 safe slot. And then. One oh, PCIe you know what? You are right. Chipset. Well, yeah. So. It looks like that was, oh, here's what I need. Okay. Could you, could you give me a picture, please? And you are correct. That was also an NVM, NVMe slot. Yeah. Oh, did I miss, did I miss screwing in one of so those? So I think slots? that one at the top is your 5.01 and your other two are your 4.0. Mm. 
I'm yeah. I'm looking for where things go in. Okay, so dims are Okay, it's interesting. It's telling me about the heat sink before putting the um Oh, here's the thingamabob. So this is the panel. So this is where I just feel very old, y'all. Things have certainly come a long way very quickly. Okay, mm -hmm. so it looks like... So that's the CPU. I'm trying to figure out where... Is this the panel? So this is where I'm just like, where does this all go? Oh, and there's fucking spots here to, to stick cords through. I'm goofy. Um, all right. System warning speaker, storage device, SPDIF. Um, I don't need, oh my God, they still have the jumper. Okay, front panel audio header. Oh, I'm looking at this entirely the wrong direction, that's why. All right, so, I may not do this right now, because I'm, I, you know how you're looking at something, you're like, this doesn't seem right. Also, I'm just like, I'm, I feel like I need to stick my head in the fucking case. Oh, this, that print on this is so small, I can't read that. I'm feeling very much like I feel my age right now. Okay. So. Reset. Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see. It's just very hard to read this way. Oh, yeah. Welcome to my least favorite part of putting together a machine. Okay. So. I see. Yeah, this is this is actually harder to read than I expected. And I don't know why. Okay, there's the audio. I don't need right now. Where do you go? What are you? Is this a USB 3 controller? I know this is probably not interesting at all, but I'm like, what the fuck am I doing? I may leave this for tomorrow once I'm ready to actually put all the drives in. So I still need to back I'm going to have to be a responsible adult and leave in about 15 minutes. That's okay. I should be a responsible adult and not try to do this when I'm tired. I'm also trying to pull all these back out so I have space. Um, the recent one really wants to be plugged in because it keeps jumping up at me. <laughs> pick me, pick me. Basically. <laughs> hey, somebody's got to be responsible, and that 5.30 alarm comes way too early. I'm going to be irresponsible as shit. Fuck that. You, you know what? You do that. You 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 pick the irresponsible side of things, and mm -hmm. I'll be responsible, and we'll Look, balance some out us, somewhere in the middle. Yeah, some of us exist in life to be a cautionary tale to others, <laughs> and that oh, is my okay. role. <laughs> I'm trying to basically plug in everything but what's definitely going on the motherboard. But now that I've done that, this side of the fucking thing is dark. So that was not my smartest move. See, Mandy, you say that sounds like you. But it feels like it is more frequent that the... Ones who suffer the consequences of your responsibility tend not to be you.
Yeah, I'm just having a moment of, can I <laughs> see that, can I pull this up? Can I like pull up the instructions online so I can see it? Versus trying to look at this tiny ass printed book. To be able to like zoom in on a PDF a little bit more. Yeah. Probably not a bad idea. And I'm like, just give me the help oh, manual. There we go. Give me Wi-Fi user manual. Can you just give me the English edition? It's like, here's one in eight languages, one of which I can read and speak. If I can zoom in on a PDF, I can actually... Hey, imagine that. What? Zooming in on a PDF? Holy shit, I can actually see this. Because the print, the right. small print book ain't it. Uh, also, some of these are still bundled up back here. Which... We'll also open up. Yeah, this is all tied to this thing. So, actually, I should bundle that back up because I don't want to connect the wrong thing to the board when I need to. Because this is the RGB and the fan controller, like for all the case fans. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, I am such a doofus. I didn't take the plastic off of the the back of the thing, and I don't know if I can like just scrape it off. So I'm worried about heat. Oh, I got like eight USB ports on this thing. That's nice. Aha. There is one thing you can never have enough of. It's absolutely USB ports. Oh yeah, because right now I've got like two fucking hey i got it ha ha success i did it Victory. Back. all right what i may do is set up to do this first thing in the morning because i'm not streaming in the morning at least i didn't plan to um but i can actually see this pdf versus the fucking board the uh tiny print I'm trying to figure out the best way to to do this. Um, I'm not going to be responsible. Hell, I may even cook something once I'm done with stream because I am still hungry. I'm just trying to figure out the best way to do this because now I can actually see what the fuck I'm doing. Uh, case fan too. So there are fan controllers in the uh yeah i think what i read there's like four different case fan spots where you can plug them in yeah and i see that now there's like case fan two case fan one so this is where you're like i don't know where nothing is <laughs> like uh it's too hard to see yeah basically <laughs> like this is really hard to see. So why did they do this? Also, I don't know what this fucking thing is for. Oh, I think I see it. But of course, it's like in a weird spot. N yes, no. Do you fit there? I'm like, do these cords all fit, or do I need to? Oh, I think I need to um disconnect. Oh shit! Did not mean to do that. There's actually um cable management. Nope, that didn't need to be done. These Corsair things are actually really good, but they're now they're in there kind of tight. Mm hmm. 
So on the one hand, yay cable management. On the other, oh god, I can't get anything to fit. <laughs> Although I think some of them are supposed to actually come this way. This is where I'm like, what am I doing? This, I think, is a... Okay, that's in the right place. I heard the snap. Yay. This is where having small hands is actually useful. Aha, here's... I know the... that life. Yep, okay. So here's the three that go together. Um... Power. This would be great if it explained where these fucking things go. Although I feel like the USB might have might need to go in last. I'm just looking for like where the power because it's power LED power switch power LED negative. These three all go together. My power went so hard into the motherboard with this last build that I did. I was worried I was going to break the MOBO. But oh, really? it just was really, really stiff cable that just did not want to, like, click into place. Oh, no. And I was like, please don't break. You're like, um, I need this. Don't break. That is not where that goes. All right. You motherfuckers, where do you go? And there was a whole point of me pulling this up, but I'm like, where is it? Oh, it's not telling me what goes where on this PDF. So I'm like, I need you to tell me what goes where. Be more specific. Well, it's like, okay, here's the fan, here's the SATA. Yeah. Um, well, in some things you're like, well, there's only one of those, and this is the same shape, so YOLO. <laughs> basically. Okay, so here. Oh my God, this fucking thing. Okay, so power connectors is one through eight. Oh, there's shit all over the board. There's like literally stuff. You know what? I'm going to connect what I can and then we might just call it a night because I'm feeling a little lost. And I'm like, I see where it should go, but this is not working. Like this one goes here. It's the only place it literally can. Would you get out of the fucking way? And yes, I'm yelling at it. I know I'm yelling at it. <laughs> okay, that's the only place it can go. Oh, it can only go one way, though. Okay, so that's connected. I'm doing this by process of elimination. You know what? That's the best way. Okay, so audio, where do you go? Yeah, those, the the power supply, or the power switch is being in the way. All right, audio, where do you go? Wow, this is really not telling me where the fucking audio goes. Yeah, it's a it's a one two uh, for the for the memory. By the way, hmm. Ah, here we go. AI pump. That is where the the liquid cooling goes. I know where the ATX goes. I know where the power goes. 
I just need you to tell me where the audio switch goes. Because mm -hmm. that one keeps getting in the way, so I want to connect it. Hello there, Flank Thomas, who says it was great seeing you, Cypher. Hey, Flank, how are you? I was deeply enjoying all of your shenanigans in LA, in San Francisco. Sorry, I was not looking at chat. I was trying to figure out where to plug in the audio. Mm -hmm. uh, that's, that's okay. That's what Taro and I are here for. Yep. <laughs> We're oh, here I to know. read out the chat, let you know what's going on. Yeah, I'm just I am fading time. fast, though. <laughs> no. Okay, CHA, that's a case fan. So. But how are you, Flank? How's the rest of your uh, post TwitchCon shenaniganry? Oh, those are, this is for the SATA drives when they go in. So I really just gotta figure out where this fucking audio thing goes because it's gonna drive me up a wall. Front panel, all of it makes me wanna cry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just like, you're in the way. Oh, wait, am I a doofus? I might be a doofus. Does that go here? Audio might have its own thing. Can I actually? Nope, that's USB. Well, shit. I picked up Welp from Mandy. And now it's part of my vocabulary. Okay, those are all in there. Also, where does this other... Oh, no, it? not the con flu. No. Oh, you want a little too hard, huh? Uh, can I get a shout-out for Flank? Flank is awesome. Uh, most talks baseball and sports a lot. Uh, I'm just mainly trying to figure out where the fuck things go. Oh, that is a front panel connector. No, thank you. Oh, you went hard, but it was worth it? Okay, okay. Okay, fan and pump. I don't have to worry about that. Power, don't have to worry about that. I know where the memory goes. Sorry, Flank. I am, it has been a long time since I built a computer, and clearly I have forgotten how things work. I'm just... Front panel audio header 15... I mean, going hard and having it be worth it is certainly a lot better than going hard and regretting it. And I've had way too many of those nights in my time. So, okay, I think definitely I finally the better option. Where the fuck this goes? Out. I was loud. Sorry. All right. If this is the same direction. Oh my god! I've been staring at it the whole fucking time. I mean, this is prob other than getting the CPU in, this is probably the worst part of building a computer. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I hate all those fiddly little connections. Yup. Also, this needs to be on this side. It does, but it's like one of those things of I'm at, I'm like in that groove of I'm almost there. I've almost got all the little fiddly bullshit done. I uh, know, I totally get that. So I'm trying to just get this audio, at least this audio connector on, and I'm like, why? Oh, that's because I was facing the wrong way with it. Because I'm smart. I'm capital S smart. The part with audio printed should be facing toward me. Which is why that wasn't going on. Hi, Kiros. Aw, puppers. He says hi, yep. He's been running around. All right, success. We did a thing. Yay. Oh, it is very successful. Hooray for doing things. Once you get that part in there. Okay, so... 
I know the power connectors, front panel audio header. It is these tiny little fucking the power supply ones that are driving me. They batty. make me so mad. Because I'm like, once you finally get them in, you're like, that's where they go. You oh, it is. Them. It is a victory. You do a little dance. Mm -hmm. There we go. Right now you're out of the way. I'm just like, why must you all be so difficult? Because I think it's all of this stuff. And that's what I hate. Because one of those things, yeah. they literally just go together. I have to say, my last build, I'm pretty proud of my cable management. This actually has decent cable management already kind of in it. Mm-hmm. Um... Because I know these go somewhere in here. I just can't tell what the order is. Yes, that is always the adventure. Because you don't want to press the power button and nothing happens because it's plugged into the wrong thing. Mm -hmm. And then you're sitting there going, did I break it? <laughs> Forbidden spaghetti. <laughs> Forbidden spaghetti. Okay, panel. All right. I know mine would end up looking like Forbidden spaghetti. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, I, I manage my cables like I manage my finances. I go in with the best of intentions, but it all goes to shit very, very quickly. I mean, wow. don't take the back off my computer. But the oh, front part looks great. You're like, this looks fantastic, as long as you don't do that part. <laughs> I just was shoving stuff in places to try to get that sucker to close at the end. Oh, mine is dis mine is an absolute disaster. Yep. Okay. Beauty up front. <laughs> Holy heck, what happened in the back? <laughs> See what I don't like? It just says panel. It doesn't uh -huh. say like what the fuck goes in there. It's just panel. It should like, have like the little layout of like the plus minuses, like which ones go where. Um, it should be like a tiny little picture of like the pins, and then there's I don't know however many. No, it just however many there are panel system panel headers. So I'm like, okay, one nineteen. You know what? It would help a lot if they just said what was what. Okay, so hard drive LED, PLED power speaker. Chassis. Okay, so hard drive LED plus. Holy shit, why is this so difficult? Okay, that's power. That is not hard drive. Power LED plus is that side of it. Power LED negative. Power. You motherfucker. Sorry, I just figured it out. So it's power LED plus negative power button. I hate this. This is the part of PC building I hate. And then every mm -hmm. time I decide, I'm going to build a computer, and then I remember this bullshit. Well, I almost stabbed myself in the foot just now. Don't, don't do that. No stabbing. Hey, it's still better than when I tried to catch a knife and wound up in the ER. That happened before I met you, Taru. Yeah, I don't remember that story. Pyro remembers that story. You probably have a scar from that story. Uh, yes, it's hard to see on my finger. I'll have to show you uh, when I see you in person. Uh... Okay. Okay, so they go this so, way. So, on page 1-19 is where I found the setup, if you were still looking. No, I got it. I just got to... You have so many. Oh, my. So many what? You have so many little penny pins. Mm-hmm. 
So it's basically power supply positive, power supply negative. Um, oops, that is not the right way. Make sure I'm doing that right. So it's positive, negative, then power button. Okay. All right, backwards. So it's positive, negative, power button. So it's these three in a row. Come on. Again, this is the part of building a PC that we all hate. Hey Siri, turn on torch. Like they always put it down at the little bottom corner so that your fingers can't totally like get all the way there. And it's just like, why? Why are you like this? Uh, and uh, just for the record, if you are trying to text me right now, it will probably show up on stream. Just so you know, because my phone is in the phone is in the PC case. There we go. Now I can actually see what the yeah. fuck I'm doing. No. Be light. Blessings. All right. The temptation to just send a text right now. This is like, hi, chat, in all caps. <laughs> I mean, if you want to expose yourself in DMs, feel free. I mean, I've exposed myself in plenty of DMs, but I'm not going to do that on the internet. That's a POS <laughs> violation. Uh, Again, why are you friends with me? I don't. I, I don't understand your life choices in this regard. I almost used your whole ass government name just now. Hey, sir, turn off. <laughs> iOS eighteen is annoying me. Sorry, it's too late. I see what you did there. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Now, I've got three political texts from the Democratic Party begging for money. <laughs> so, I'm just like, if anyone texts me right now, just know that your text may show up on screen if my, my phone is in the case. All right, but I got that part done. I just feel like there's a bunch of wires that I'm missing somewhere or things that won't get connected quite yet. Where's that? Okay, here is. Where do you go? Because this is a... This goes to something in the back, and I don't remember what. But this clearly is one of these two prong ones. I think there's only two options. So this goes somewhere. Where does it go? Who knows? All right. Oh, here's more cords. I'm like, where did these all come from? I'm like, I'm missing cords. Where are they? Oh, this is to this. So this needs to get connected somewhere. So that is that fan. I will figure out where that fan plugs in shortly. 
I think everything else will have to be on hold until I get hard drives and the cooler in because um, I need to back up all of my data and uh, probably pull out the M2 that's currently in my machine. Because mm. I got an M2 enclosure from when the other computer croaked. Aha. Where do you? Reset. Reset. Where do you go? I feel like I'm missing a couple cords. They have to be in here. They, they're all connected. Reset. So wherever the hard drive LED is as well, that is not showing up. Ooh. Yeah, because the rest of these are like getting the set is in and Aha. Nope, that's Thunderbolt. I don't need that. Like thermal sensor. Um, reset. You are. Why are you like this? So basically the reset is on the other side of the power switch. Mm. Yeah, there's just like little things that are... Ah, where did you go? Hello, DocSense Studios. Thank you for the resub. Hey, Liz. All right, reset is plugged in. Still missing the hard drive. So they have to be in here somewhere. It's kind of like, well, now I'm on a roll, you know? Yep. Mm -hmm. You've hit that, hit that streak. You're like, I can't stop now. I must keep going. Oh, I could stop. Don't worry. But it's just more of a, where the fuck are these connectors? Hey, where's Bangal? I mean, to be fair, that I think that's most people's reaction to when my voice appears, regardless of whether it's on my channel or not. <laughs> like, what the, what the fuck? All right. Hired and I are lurking. Yes, while I struggle bus to build a computer. But this may be as far as... Why is this fucking laptop? I swear to God. I mean, you got a lot done for a little over two hours, buddy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's, that's a lot of progress. Oh, I know. I'm just trying to figure out, like, where the connectors, like, the missing connectors that are that are not plugged in, like, where are they? Because they wouldn't have come disconnected. Because this is the fan, once I put it back. So I know where that goes eventually. It's just more of a, I know there's other connectors. Where the fuck are they? Mm-hmm. They might be bundled up in the back of the case a little bit. Possib. I'm just having one of those, where are the rest of you? Like I said, some of them I can't do anything with until I, um, okay, because that actually is going into the controller in the back. It is already connected. Yeah, like some of these are already connected, like and cable managed, but there's missing connectors that are not plugged in yet. Mm. Okay, so here's another USB, but it's it's from the back where the where the connector is. So TLDR, there's a couple connections where I probably just have to hunt for the end. They have to be in this case. Like, where else would they be? There's just more of a, what am I doing? Where are my, con where's the rest of my connectors? Because the, the, the PSU and the hard drive case are going to go in here. Mm -hmm. 
so but yeah I think that may be it because for now I don't think I can do much more and the rest are probably power connectors that are going to be more on the PSU than anything else mm -hmm. versus like from the motherboard yeah yeah I'm just having that let me not lose anything <laughs> but yeah I think we're I think we're good Yay, victory! Hooray! Ba ba ba. Ba 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 ba. What? Yeah, I'm st Well, there go a bunch of screws. These are probably the shorter screws I should have used on the motherboard, but oh well. It's in there now. Don't be like me when you try to make things. <laughs> All right, let's end. Hopefully people can hear me. They can, okay, they can hear me. Because, yep. well, I had to update um, OBS on my laptop. So of course it's like, who who are you? What is all of this? Yes. Uh, I have so no memory of this place. Yeah, right. <laughs> Basically, so Street Grind is on with Tekken. Bronze is on with Alien Dark Descent. Oh, Versachico is on with uh, Dragon Age Inquisition. Got to meet Versace at PAX West. They are also fledgling into Magic the Gathering. And I'm usually not on this time of night. One of us. One of us. Yes, we, we played Commander yes. at PAX West, and it was a whole thing. Mandy was not there to destroy us with her deck. Mm -hmm. All right, let's read uh, Versace, since she's playing my favorite game, like, ever. If I could type, I'd be dangerous. <laughs> read Versa Versace. Uh, P what's a good raid call since we were building a PC? Techie raid? Go for it. I, 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 I'm just like running through my brain for potential puns on a, a raid device, and that's, you, no, I've, I've annoyed you enough tonight. You have an annoying... I was kind of thinking, fuck that one screw. <laughs> but that's yeah. not really... <laughs> yeah. That may not work for a raid call. Twitch may be no, like... Not for a raid call, but like uh, those, that's the vibe. It's, it's the vibe. Uh, thanks for hanging out, y'all. What I may do um, Saturday is, depend if I've got my data backed up, we may try to finish the computer build, or I may do that offline. But either way, let's go see what Versace's doing. I didn't get a chance to see them at TwitchCon, sadly. So it'll be nice to raid, and then I'm going to go figure out a snack.